with the ninth pick in the 2018 NBA Draft, the New York Knicks select Kevin Knox from the University of Kentucky. Oh no! Oh, this is this is now guaranteed that Kevin oh, Knox is wow. going to have an All-Star NBA career because the Porzingis dudes are going thumbs down. I think now wow. they may be trying. That may just be a good luck move now. Yeah, I think yeah, I think it's wishful, <laughs> they're, they're, <laughs> wishful thinking. That's what they're doing. Reverse psychology. Cal Perry said the teams that passed on Kevin Knox in a couple of years might regret it. He compared him to Jason Tatum in terms of the way he can mature and get better. You know, his dad was a football player. Kevin was a quarterback. With the 10th pick in the 2018 NBA Draft, the Philadelphia 76ers select Mikael Bridges from Villanova University. There's some Sixer fans in the house. Tom McHale's mom, Tanisha Rivers, who was fired up about this pick. Since 2008, Dante DiVincenzo's college teammate, awaiting to hear his name called. Since 2008, Bridges is the ninth four-year college player to make it into the top ten. He continually improved. He was a third-team All-American last year, as Jay mentioned, a two-time national champion. It comes out of the culture, Jay, that you have referred to as the best in college basketball and one that would seemingly really prepare you for pro life. Oh, he is absolutely prepared. And this is a first for Villanova basketball. This is a first. With the 11th pick in the 2018 NBA Draft, the Charlotte Hornets select Shea Gilgis Alexander from Hamilton, Canada and the University of Kentucky. Second Wildcat taken tonight as John Calipari continues to have his players make it to the draft. And Gilgis Alexander, as the season went on last year, emerged as the leader for Kentucky. And some believe that perhaps he was as good as Trey Young, Colin Sexton. The opportunity to have a big impact in the NBA. And now he joins a Charlotte team that made its 14th lottery pick in the last 15 seasons. What are they getting in Gilgis Alexander? Well, they're getting a guy with excellent size. Jay Gilgis Alexander is over 6'6". He's got a 7-foot wingspan. He's an excellent defender. With the 12th pick in the 2018 NBA Draft, the LA Clippers select Miles Bridges from Michigan State University. So Miles Bridges, the latest great basketball player to come from Flint Town, as Tom Izzo has another Spartan selected tonight, the second Michigan State player that has been picked in the lottery. Bridges left Flint Southwestern High School for Huntington Prep. His mom wanted him to go pro last year, but during his first year at Michigan State, he was alone in the basketball building, or so he thought. And some of the staff heard him walking through going, I love this place. So he stuck around for a second year on the banks of the old red cedar, had a good season, and now he's off to the NBA. Clippers selecting him, but this pick is going to Charlotte. A powerful athlete. Miles Bridges is a lefty. Uh, super lottery athlete. pick. Let's go to the commissioner. With the 13th pick in the 2018 NBA draft, the LA Clippers select Jerome Robinson from Boston College. Jerome Robinson, the high-scoring BC Eagle, is the first Boston College player ever taken in the lottery. Lottery started in 1985, and he is on his way to the Clippers after having just a sensational season. First-team all-conference performer in the ACC. Grew up in Raleigh, a fan of the Tar Heels, and then spent his career bedeviling not only the Tar Heels, but pretty much everybody in the ACC, Jay. Jerome Robinson it may be the most complete offensive player in this NBA draft. He's a versatile scorer, very quick with the ball. He's got a high release on his jumper, and he's got a good mid-range game. He can shoot it from three, and he's very good. With the 14th pick in the 2018 NBA draft, the Denver Nuggets select Michael Porter Jr. from the University of Missouri. All smiles now because once you're selected, 
The goal was just to produce. He'll have that opportunity, and we hope certainly that he's at full health. As you probably know, lower back surgery in late November. At that time, prior to the surgery, he was listed by our Jonathan Gavoni as the second overall pick. Didn't win in either game when he came back at the end of the season as Missouri was beaten in the SEC tournament by Georgia and then lost the first game of the NCAA tournament. But Michael Porter Jr., an immense talent, and now Denver. We have another trade to announce. The Charlotte Hornets trade the draft rights to Shea Gilgis Alexander, the 11th pick, to the LA Clippers for the draft rights to Miles Bridges, the 12th pick, and two future second round picks. And with the 15th pick in the 2018 NBA draft, the Washington Wizards select Troy Brown Jr. from the University of Oregon. Troy Brown. Not here tonight, but an all-freshman team honorable mention player in the Pac-12. With the 16th pick in the 2018 NBA Draft, the Phoenix Suns select Zaire Smith from Texas Tech mm. University. Wow. Wow. That's a defensive player. Okay. You see DeAndre nodding. Zaire Smith is a very explosive player out of Texas Tech, but we are hearing that this pick is going to move from Phoenix and go to Philadelphia with the 76ers. That's what we're hearing right now. Uh, let's check in with Woj. Woj, you have some details on this? Guys, uh, Philadelphia has traded the rights of Mikel Bridges to the Phoenix Suns for Zaire Smith. With the 17th pick in the 2018 NBA Draft, the Milwaukee Bucks select Dante DiVincenzo from Villanova University. The most outstanding player of the Final Four of the national champions of Jay Wright, Dante DiVincenzo. Sophomore guard from Villanova had 31 points in the championship game. No one from a winning team had had more since the field expanded. Danny Manning put up 31. Glenn Rice put up 31, just as DiVincenzo did. They call him the big ragu, and he is a big leaper in addition to being a tremendous shooter. As we take a look at one of the Mountain Dew Kickstart Rising Stars, pick in the 2018 NBA Draft, the San Antonio Spurs select Lonnie Walker IV from the University of Miami. Lonnie Walker IV on his way to San Antonio. You see the embrace with his dad. Lonnie's dad, when he was a kid, made him read for an hour every day before he could go out and play. This is a guy with a lot of interest, loves the Discovery Channel and Animal Planet. When Jim Laranega was recruiting him, as you see him hugging Jim Laranega there, sometimes they would talk about why Jaguars were able to catch ostriches when they should have been able to. It wasn't always basketball with Lonnie. I did several of his games. Really engaging young man and a terrific athlete and player. He showed some of that athleticism, particularly after he got healthy. Time for looking ahead with Lonnie Walker here, Jake. 